Welcome or welcome back to my channel everyone. In today's video, I'll be showing how I made these DIY elegant wall and table decor pieces, the black and gold edition. If you're interested, then just keep on watching. I'll be using this multi-pack two-piece canvas set that I picked up from Dollar Tree in the $5 plus aisle. And the first thing I'm gonna do is remove the plastic. I'm using this baking sheet to put my liquids and my glitter on and I'm using this black acrylic paint, gold glitter, and my foam brush to mix everything up. Once this dries a little bit, I'll add a second coat. Repeat the same steps for my second canvas. Overall, I applied about two to three coats of this mixture. Now that they're both dry, I'm flipping them over to adhere them together. Of course, if you are going to recreate these projects, I suggest using a stronger adhesive so they can last over time. I purchased these clamps from Home Depot a few years ago, but they do sell these at the Dollar Tree if you are looking for a more affordable price. And I'm just using these to help mold my canvases together. I'm using my silver Sharpie to draw some squiggly lines so I can know exactly where to glue my gold ice rocks. For this next step, all I'm doing is putting the glue down and then placing my ice rocks on top. And if you are going to use this hot glue, then you may wanna use a little bit at a time since the hot glue do dry fast. This is what I have so far, and since these lines are looking a little skimpy to me, I'm going to add a few more ice rocks to each line. This DIY elegant wall decor black and gold edition turned out exactly how I imagined, but tell me what y'all think down in the comments. As if my wall decor wasn't beautiful as is, I'm gonna use this pearl wrap to show y'all how y'all can glam it up a little bit more. For this step, I'm just gluing some black ice rocks along the sides and then I'm going to glue some on top of the gold ones and that's going to hide any visible glue that's showing through the bottom. I think I like this one much better. The black ice rocks definitely give it a different look but tell me what y'all think down in the comments. For this next project, I'll be working with these black candles that I picked up from my local Dollar Tree. And the first thing I'm gonna do is remove the labels. Then I'll be adhering this self-adhesive diamond wrap, but first I'm cutting off the excess strings along the sides. When you peel the paper off, be sure that the adhesive is sticking to the diamonds and not the paper.
Now I'm gluing more ice rocks along the entire bottom. I'm repeating those same exact steps along the top. I'm loving the way these candles turned out. The ice rocks definitely gives any piece a different look. But tell me what y'all think down in the comments. I had to go on ahead and add the black ice rocks and I must say I'm really loving how these turned out. Comment down below and let me know what your favorite is. For this last and final project, I'm using these black vases that I picked up from Dollar Tree as well. And I'm going to start by peeling the stickers off. I'll also be using four of these circle Dollar Tree mirrors. So I'm just cleaning them off and then I'm going to glue the vases to my mirrors. Now I'm gluing the other two mirrors right on top. Even though these can be glued down, I'm not gonna use any glue. I'm just gonna scatter them along the bottom. I enjoyed creating these black and gold edition DIYs. I think they all turned out super glam. Don't forget to comment below what your favorite is. Please like and share. And if you're curious to see what else I can create, hit that subscribe button and turn on your notifications so you don't miss my next video.